Welcome to KDS. Once upon a time, there was a dog named Adil. Adil was a loyal and loving companion to his owner, and he spent his days playing fetch, going on walks, and cuddling with his family. One day, Adil owner decided to take him on a camping trip in the mountains. Adil was very excited, as he had never been on a camping trip before. He eagerly jumped into the car and wagged his tail as they drove towards the mountains. As they set up their tent in a clearing, Adil began to explore his new surroundings. He sniffed around the trees and bushes, chasing after squirrels and rabbits. But as the sun began to set, Adil realized that he was lost. He had wandered too far from the campsite, and he couldn't remember the way back. Adil started to panic. He barked and howled, hoping that his owner would hear him and come to his rescue. But his owner was too far away to hear him, and Adil was alone in the wilderness. As the night grew darker, Adil became more and more scared. He had never been alone in the wilderness before, and he didn't know how to find his way back to the campsite. He curled up in a ball and whimpered, feeling hopeless and alone. But just when Adil had given up all hope, he heard a soft, comforting voice. It was an old, wise dog who had been living in the wilderness for many years. The old dog had seen Max wandering alone and had followed him to make sure he was safe. The old dog took Adil under his wing, showing him how to find food and shelter in the wilderness. He taught Adil how to follow his instincts and how to use his senses to find his way back to the campsite. Adil learned so much from the old dog and he was grateful for his guidance. Eventually, Adil and the old dog found their way back to the campsite. Adil's owner was overjoyed to see him and Adil was relieved to be back in the safety of his family's care. The moral of this story is that even when we feel lost and alone, there is always someone who is willing to help us. Adil learned that sometimes we need to rely on the wisdom and experience of others, and that we can find strength in the kindness and compassion of those around us. Please subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon for more stories.